the Seattle Seahawks on their way to their first Super Bowl in 30 years. But Deshaun Foster spoke on behalf of his Panthers teammates. You know, they came up a little short, but yeah. it sounds like uh, they're ready to go for odd six already. Listen to this. Well, now, buddy boy, I got a puss on. We gave our best, but today it wasn't good enough. We're down, but not out. Tomorrow's a new day. We may have lost the battle, but we are going to win the war. Wow. Yeah. I didn't know. I hadn't heard Deshaun speak before. Game played at UCLA. You might remember them from I'd there, seen but. some press conferences, but it's tough when you're seeing the image of the guy. I've never heard him on the radio, just a voice isolated. It sounds it's different. different. Yeah, yeah, you picture different, a different right. guy. And uh, we'll talk more football as we go along, but also wanted to, to talk about Antonio Davis, the Knickerbockers forward, who, of course, mm-hmm. jumped into the stands last week yeah. to defend his wife. You know, a lot of he said, she said, who was right. responsible for the whole thing. Heck yeah. Antonio Davis, the NBA, you know, Commissioner David Stern. Now, is he a forward? Yes. He's a power forward. Big forward. Right. Antonio Davis, you mm-hmm. know. He, uh, David Stern, gave him a five-game suspension, but mm-hmm. a- and the fan wants an apology. Mm-hmm. No such apology really? on its way. Keep wow. waiting, says Antonio Davis. Listen to this. The commission's spoken, and now it's my turn. Where I come from, you don't put your mitts on another fella's gal. That schnook was looking at her like he wanted to take a slow elevator to China with her. Wow. Yeah, so you can say, I mean, he was upset. Obviously, yeah. <laughs> right. Wow, you know, it's so... Uh... That's really that's really the you know that's why they, they call very similar they, call, Sean Foster they sound a lot alike maybe they, maybe they uh, grew up in the same region of the are, country or something black, I guess right? my, my ear I didn't get that but anyway they're but they're both black yeah sometimes sometimes people, yeah. Well, you know. sometimes people, people of the same sort of ethnicity or culture start to sound alike maybe. and I think maybe that was it but well, also I think that's why they call radio theater of the mind because when you're watching these guys on TV it just doesn't feel like this it feels totally different when you isolate their voice.